And in this game, my friend, I'm, I'm going to give give you my underappreciated oh. player of the week. Well, go on then. And I'm going to uh, I'm going to say this mostly in, in the hope that you understand that I mean. If I gave you a picture or gave most people a picture of James Garner, I guess eight out of ten wouldn't even know he's a Premier League footballer. That's kind of mm. how mm. sort of underappreciated or un- un- unknown he is. But he's a young player who came up from Manchester United, was bought for £50 million, pounds, so somewhere around $20 million, has been one of the most consistent players under Sean Dyche since he's been at Everton. Play, can play in a number of positions. Was outstanding, I thought, yesterday in just his appreciation, his ability, his, his tactical IQ, his... his Clearances. I had some numbers, Rob. Like he's sixty-three touches of the ball, thirteen ball recoveries, f- four clearances, eleven final third passes, three long passes, three dribbles into the box, and my man of the match. And he's a player, Rob. Who, if we think of Everton, we thought maybe the goalie, and then you know Brantwaite mm. and, mm. and Tarkovsky as a back two, and we think of mm. Ducore doing good things, and mm. Dominic Calvert Lewin. Mm. And maybe McNeil, who got the goal, mm. and Jack yeah. Harrison's come in and gives. Yeah. He never really is, is somebody who would, who's under the radar, and under the radar is underappreciated. So my underappreciated, underappreciated player of the week goes to James Garner. Yeah, I really like it. I really like it. I, I tell you, when I look at this lineup, Rob, in terms of what's different, because I got a better vibe feel about this team from really early on, and I know the yeah. results weren't great at the beginning, but I, I think a couple. You might have mentioned actually all the players, Rob. Jared Branthwaite, I thought, was outstanding yeah. again. Him mm. and Tarkovsky is a yeah. game changer for Everton. That's a game changer. Young player, Branthwaite. I think he signed a new contract. Big player for the future. Excellent. James Garner, yeah. to your point, And then Jack Harrison. They're the three, really, it's in the team at the moment that's different, that makes them a better side. So mm. I, I really like your shout, Rob, because James Garner can play. Right, he can play. He's different to a mm. totally different to an Onana, Decore, or a Drizagana Gay. He's got a bit more technicality. Yeah. So you put him alongside, and it's, it's Gana Gay at the moment, but it's going to be Onana when he gets uh, recovers from yeah. his illness. Actually, the it's, two of them yeah. together with Decore in front, making those runs into the box, I really like it. And I think you're absolutely spot on, James Garner, 22 years of age, big future. Gives them something different, and that blend, you know, in midfield. There's a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Um, I think it's a lovely blend yeah. in there that keeps possession of the football. Um, so I like it. I really like it, Robert James Garner. Yeah, I think he's been an mm. excellent addition, and uh, it's a good shout and and a great, a great three points for Everton Football Club. And Sean Dyche is the man, the perfect yeah. man to have right now, going through these difficult moments. I like him a lot. Played against him back in the day. Brilliant bloke, and again, just the ideal man to to kind of keep things calm. Um, through these very difficult waters now. Again, now, Rob, they're only two points behind Luton. Yeah, massive, massive Which December, is, isn't it? December with yeah. so many points at, yeah. at stake is, is going to be massive for, for all those clubs yeah. uh, in and around the, the bottom of the bottom three. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host for NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. And for even more Premier League content, from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock. And be sure to tune in for Premier League mornings every weekend on USA Network and on Peacock. We will see you there.